Hello there and welcome back to another video for Final Fantasy XIV. Today a quick one talking about the allocation of rewards from the previous season of PvP Crystalline Conflict that just went by. As you know there are two seasons of ranked PvP in an entire patch length, so between major patches, so 6.1 until 6.2. So the second season of ranked PvP started today for ranked, which means that people who took part in the last season of PvP should be able to get their rewards today. If you do, uh, did actually take part in any ranked at all um, of Crystalline Conflict, then you will probably notice that you've been reverted down. I think it's like three stars previous or something. So it's put me down to bronze. I was only in silver. I say only in silver, but it gave me, you know, something to do. And I didn't do that many runs, honestly. But um, yeah, I might actually push it a bit further this time. But if you actually go over here to the Wolf's Den Pier, uh, before patch 6.2 comes out, make sure you come over here to the Conflict Shit Exchange. Uh, that's exactly what it says, the seasonal quartermaster, as this person is <laughs> clearly demonstrating for us here. Good job. And uh, you'll be able to get your rewards. How do I get my thing? Interesting. Oh, there we go. All I had to do was click on the second option. Sorry, I clicked claim tier reward. Oh, I see. So that gave me the silver framers kit. So that's how we got our reward. I presume then that means that the other, like the ranking reward is for other things. Interesting. But yeah, claim tier reward. And out of that, we got an achievement, as you can see. If we go into our recent, we actually got a title. So you get different ones depending on whatever tier you were in. I got the title Silver Bearer because I managed to actually get to Silver um, which hopefully I can I can do better this time in this season. But it says complete a crystalline conflict season in silver tier. So if you did bronze at all, you'll have bronze bearer and so on and so forth. You also get a frame. In this case, I got the silver framers kit. Uh, you'll notice that I didn't get the bronze framers kit. So if I wanted to get the bronze one as well, I would presumably have to deliberately uh, get bronze in a season. It doesn't backdate to previous ones, which is... I suppose, you know, a reason to do it again. But the Silver Framers kit will allow us to then customize our adventurer plate and portrait stuff, right? So once we've got our Silver Framers kit learnt, you'll find that under the character menu under portraits, we'll have access to actually putting that stuff on. So let's just show you what those look like. And obviously if you're in crystal or whatever tier you're in, yours is gonna be completely different. But we can change this, as you can see, Silver Conflict as a background. So we've got this nice silver sort of themed PvP background that you can just about see. If I move my character, there we go. As you can see, look, that's what the silver background looks like. Uh, then we also have a frame, which should be here, silver conflict. So again, that's what the frame looks like. Kind of almost like Garlemald, actually, that silver. I can imagine the gold one looks a lot nicer. I think this season I might push to try and get gold at least. And uh, the accent... As you can see, Silver Conflict Arms gives you this, basically. I think that's the season number, isn't it? Season 1, and then the Silver Frame. So, yeah, if you want to, you know, at least get the background or something, these are definitely worth it. So these are the main rewards for your PvP ranked stuff. Again, if you're not into frames and things like that, it's probably not going to be your cup of tea. But personally, I think this is the way it's going to have to be. i much rather have, you know, your rewards in this fashion and uh, you know your your major rewards as a part of the series instead. You might disagree. Let me know what you think. If uh, many of you are crystal, let me know if you're going to use any of these frames, and uh, if you're happy like I am that you took part in PvP. And uh, I I personally really enjoyed it. So hopefully I can push it a bit further, learn how to do a bit more PvP, and uh, we'll see if we can get gold at least this time. Awesome stuff. Much love. Enjoy the rest of your day. Make sure you claim this stuff before 6.2, otherwise you won't be able to get it at the Wolfstone Pier. And I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.